suck on my gun. Container, that's probably more important than remains, honestly. Well, I mean, the remains have better shit than the container, so maybe <laughs> I was wrong. Um, do we have to fight them? Doesn't seem like it. If they're willing to follow us, sure, but like... Because there are a shit ton of red dots over here, too. Everybody on the Glorn. I want to hit the thing beside it. Because this shotgun's more of a grenade launcher than it is a, sh a shotgun. Nickel, there's something here. I know those guys, my guys are fighting over there, but like... Oh, okay, that's what that is. Perfect. Got the data pad. Reload. Maybe we can change out our loadout. Um, I mean, the shotgun's pretty badass. What do we get for a sniper rifle? Got a Viper 2. I think this is a sniper rifle that I wanted, so... Yes, put it on this one. I think this is the one I wanted. It's three round magazine, so it's not very many, but... Oh, yeah, but it does the damage that I'm looking for. Yes. We have two weapons that are very low in ammo, though, so... That's kind of a concern, right? But, I mean, it's, we just gotta be conservative with this one and this one. I mean, not necessarily as conservative, but, like, just be careful. Be aware. Because, like, if we have no ammo, we're in trouble. It's, like, there's nothing about it. No ammo, uh, no killing. And then we die. Pick up the containers. Oh, finally the container and something good this time. I'm, I'm assuming this is the research thing. Yeah, the monolith. Okay. Let's put both of our guys onto that. I don't know what the head is on this thing. Probably the eyeball. Yeah. So if we hit in the eyeball, we were gonna fucking we we fuck it up pretty good. Just gotta make sure hitting the eyeball. Okay. Definitely thought I was full of my magazine was full, but apparently not. There we go. Yeah, this thing does not have much ammo. I guess we have to just make sure to find ammo pickups as we go. I mean, there are a couple enemies here, like more enemies than. Oh shit! I don't like that. Throw a little biotics at it if we can. See if we can, can't get it to stop doing what it's doing. The charge seems like it'd be useful. Get behind its shield. Scan the shit out of that guy. Remnant stuff. Assemblers. Oh, oh that's health. Shit. Nickel? I don't think that's what we're looking for. Oh, a tree. Mushroom. Scan the mushroom, I suppose. Um, is that what was beeping here? The mushroom? Really? <laughs> oh. Can you not follow us in here, you dickhead? This planet's weird. Let's be careful around the native flora, okay, everyone? If you get any fungal slime on your side. Yes, yes, we heard this already. Let's get over here. High ground is good for snipers. We're taking the high ground. We may have to go up anyway, but we're taking the high ground. Aha, a panel. Oh. I guess these are the stasis people. Okay. Oh, shit. Decryption impossible to missing glyphs information. Scan nearby surrounding information for glyphs. Okay. There's one tour. The researchers caught the stasis field. Exactly where one right here. 
And one, right? Oh, get closer, come on. There we go. So I guess, technically speaking, I could do this... If I knew the code, I could do it without the glyphs. But, in theory, that would be very difficult. So this one... Okay. This glyph has to be over here. So let's give this the upside down thinger. Give that one. Yeah, that matches. Okay. So. Oh, I hate pseudocos. Pseudocos, however you want to say it. So this one can't be that. So it has to be. This one. This one has to be. The first one there. Okay, we're getting somewhere. So we got a three. That's pretty easy to solve. Is it that one? Yeah, it looks like that one. There's a three there. It has to be that one as well. So now we're stuck with these two here. And it has to work out eventually. Like, these need to work that it, like it, it just will work, right? Um, okay, so, got dun, dun, dun. So this one is that one, and this one is DOS one. Since we have that, we need the A, we got the A, we need that. Right? Perfect! I don't understand why that was so difficult. Scott! Scotting stars! What? Who are you? How did... Pathfinder Rider, with the Andromeda Initiative. I'm... from another galaxy. Take a moment. Find your bearings. More aliens? Out of nowhere? And Jal? Do none of you remember getting frozen? Frozen? I don't understand. We were just working on the monolith and then... And then you appeared. You should return to Palev. Kieran will want to speak to you. Maybe you're right. Oh, I feel a head splitter coming on. We should make sure they return to the station. Who knows what lingering effects they might suffer from. Will do, boss. Will do. This Sam of yours in your head. How is it allowing you to interface with the remnant? Sam helps with analysis and translation, among other things. It's complicated. Anything else? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, back we go. There's got to be some dickheads on the way back, right? That only makes sense. Like, we can't just get through here that easily. But, I mean, this is kind of like a side planet, so it could be that easy. But... Ask and I shall receive, I suppose. It looks like we're just wildlife, though. So... It could be okay to just skip it. Let's do this! Okay, never mind. Let's do this. I don't see him. Oh, there they are. Ah! Stop moving, you dickhead. I hit him. Not necessarily doing what I wanted to, though. Okay, so we got that on him. Let's switch our, our shotgun here and go after the sharpshooter. Had, oh, there we go. Don't see the other people. It looks like there was just those two in this immediate vicinity. Let's hit up the map. Let's see how we get back. Um, so it looks like just like a straight and up. Like a straight out and left. Pretty simple. I, got, I don't know if running is faster or not. Like I feel like it should be. But at the same time like this. That feels pretty quick. But there's also like the downtime of not moving. Don't know what caused that fire. But let's be careful. <laughs> Maybe we can find out what caused the fire. There's something beeping. Ah, whatever. We'll skip that. Oh, is this something I can collect? Good work. Doesn't look like it. 
back to the old research facility. Get back up. Oh, that was a weird, weird climb. But whatever, I'll take it. <laughs> as long as we're back. Jump. Boom. Let's go talk to... I got... We got one person to speak to. I think the other people didn't... Different? We didn't answer the, anybody else's concerns. You weren't lying. Kieran told us everything. She even had pictures. I apologize for the indifferent welcome you received from me earlier. Don't worry about it. You had no reason to trust me. The last aliens you met were Ket. Ryder, what you have done here, your remnant understanding, and your Sam should convince Ephra. You're an asset. We should speak to him as soon as we can. Perhaps on the Tempest? Here and I've been thinking, if Ryder can use remnants, couldn't we fix the monoliths? Stop Havarl's decline. Havarl's decline? This will take time to explain. We can discuss it further when you have time. <laughs> You were saying something about the planet being in decline? It doesn't look like it, but Havarl is sick. It started here, uncontrolled mutations in organic life, killing some, turning others into poison. We're starting to see the same elsewhere. The planet's ecosystem is crumbling, slowly but surely. It's the monoliths. There are only two of them when there should be three. There's so much life here. Your vault must be working. In some fashion, most likely. But the monoliths are responsible for propagating the vault's instructions across the planet. With only two out of three monoliths working, the instructions are imbalanced. So life is imbalanced. We've never tried asking the sages. There could be something in their oral history. Stars, those superstitious hermits don't care about modern Angara. You know that. You saw the projections for the planet's survival. What do we have to lose? Is there no other option? Couldn't we trace the location of the third monolith from the two we know about? Oh, we've tried that. But the connections between monoliths have deteriorated. The trek up Mithrather's teeming with Remnant. Most of us don't attempt it, but maybe you could do it. Follow the Remnant River, and keep your head. I'd hate to hear something terrible happened in pursuit of some ancient legend. Perfect. Now we got something additional to do. Um, find the outpost site. On Vold. Find the entrance to the sanctuary. I'd like to do that one. Yes, please. Might as well fix this planet before we leave. How far out is that? Oof. We don't have a vehicle, do we? Doesn't look like we have a vehicle. What's this? Oh, it's like the different places and levels. Um, there's no vehicle. Might as well do our skills. Level up the boys here. Energy drain. Oh, got a sticky grenade. Avenger strike cloaks before swiftly repositioning for a deadly strike from behind. Ooh, that's cool as well. Rebel soldier gives him. Oh, console. That's why. Stupid console. Charles training improves his defensive capabilities. Weapon damage and weapon force. How many points do we need? Eighteen. Ah, oh, fuck. I like the energy drain. That's kind of cool. Maybe we'll give them sticky grenades too. Then give them a little rebel soldier. A little resilience. Let's lock Jaw down. Drawl. Drac. Sorry. These boys... Projectiles is split on impact. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, that's pretty useful too. Incinerate. That's kind of cool. Blood rage. It's pretty badass too. We could probably just 
max the shit out of this. Health regeneration rate, so we can't die. But like, it's one ore and then one ore. It's not just like one path. I, I think I kind of want to go with that. Movement speed and melee damage, is that be good. Duration per kill, bonus. Ooh, well, yeah, health threshold. When Drac is near death and has not done so recently, he ignores any research times and enters blood rage. Oh, I, I think we got to go with that one automatically. Um, but this is like, which one do we go with? He heals faster, or does he do more damage and move faster? He already... He, we could just build him into health and not worry about that. I like that. Let's just upgrade the shit out of his one skill. <laughs> and make him super powerful in that one area. Hey, we'll take it. It seems pretty useful. Um, biotics. Well, apparently we're going heavy into biotics, which are pretty cool. Lance. Lance is pretty cool. Um. Singularity. We'd like more damage per second, honestly. But in tech, is there anything we're looking for? I don't think so. I mean, combat, we put... I mean, essentially we wasted stuff into combat here, but... We need combat fitness up. Yeah. We need that to get another weapon. So more into combat fitness. So, I was going to head out there and do uh, that one mission that saves this planet. But it looks like we're pretty much coming up to a lot of time in this one recording session. And I don't really necessarily want to mess around with having messed up footage once again. So, that'll probably be it for now. We have explored another planet. We're getting the Angara onto our side and hopefully... Hopefully they are already on our side after this one, but we're going to try to do all their their side stuff to really solidify our friendship with them. So thank you for watching. If you liked it, please leave a like. Like to see more, subscribe. And hold on, I'm almost on the top. Almost there. Almost there. Okay. And thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time in Mass Effect Andromeda.